The regional capital of the Upper River region witnessed the inauguration of another groundbreaking project. The Basse Central Mosque was officially opened to the public at a grand ceremony, attended by the President of the Republic, His Excellency Adam Barro, Cabinet Ministers, regional government officials, and a cross section of the community of Basse. The construction of the mosque was funded by business tycoon Hamidou Ja at an estimated cost of $100 million. For the people of Basse, it was an occasion to celebrate and return gratitude to the donor after years of delays that almost put the project in doubt. Now the town has a new mosque with a capacity to accommodate more than a thousand worshippers. The inaugural prayer service was led by Imam Cherno Musa Tal, who delivered a long sermon and later conducted the two Raka Juma prayer. Speaking after the prayer service, the Alcala of Basse Seluba could not hide his excitement at the completion of what he called one of the most important projects in the regional settlement. He thanked Hamidou Jah for the philanthropic gesture, explaining how the community elders have exhausted all avenues to have the mosque completed. He also expressed gratitude to the President of the Republic for gracing the historic inauguration of the mosque urging him to personally support the management of the mosque and its facilities. Imam Cherno Musa Tal said the people of Basse are greatly honored to inaugurate the edifice which will enhance the socio-religious development of the community, whilst also calling on the president to support philanthropists like Hamidou Ja, as they contribute immensely to the socio-economic development of the country. The Minister of Fisheries, Musa Drame, also acknowledged the positive contributions of the Ja oil boss, describing his work as phenomenal. He also commended President Barrow for enhancing religious freedoms through his non-interference in religious affairs, urging all Gambians to pray for peace and stability in the Gambia. The Fisheries Minister enjoined the Community and Mosque Committee to take good care of the mosque and ensure its upkeep to serve its intended purpose. The President, His Excellency Adam Abaro, equally paid tribute to Hamidou Ja for his contributions to the development of society, hailing the mosque as the most beautiful in the country. Going down memory lane, President Abaro recounted the evolution of the Basse Mosque to its current state, summing events as a dream come true for the people of Basse. The president called on the community of Basse to support Hamidi Ja as he continues to sponsor more religious projects across the country. He also thanked the elders and the people of Basse for the patience, disclosing that his government will construct the road leading from the mosque to Dembakunda. As he left, President Barrow was seen off by crowds who had gathered outside the mosque compound. Mamoru Jalo, JRTS News.